Hi, welcome to the GPAC preparation series 3 test number 16. This test series will be helpful in preparation for the GPAC exam. We wish you all the best. Before we start the test, let us understand the process. So, here is the process. This test consists of 10 questions and you will get 7 seconds to write your answer in the comments. For example, if the answer to question 1 is option B, you can write it in the comments as 1B. Similarly, if the answer to question 2 is option A, you can write it in the comments as 2A. So, the first question is. An example of hemopoietic growth factor is. Option A, platelet-derived factor. Option B, epidermal growth factor. Option C, iron dextran. Option D, erythropoietin. As you know, you have got 7 seconds. If you know the answer, mention it in the comments. The time starts now. The time is over. I hope you got it right. The correct option is C, that is iron dextran. Now let us quickly move to question number 2. A direct way of studying idiosyncratic reactions to the given drug is by Option A, changing the route of drug administration. Option B, change the assay method. Option C, pharmacogenomic. Option D, structure activity relationship studies of a family of compounds. You have got 7 seconds. If you know the answer, mention it in the comments. The time starts now. So, the time is over. Let us see the correct answer. The right option is C, that is pharmacogenomic. I hope you are participating in the test and writing the answers in the comments. That is awesome. Let us move ahead. So, the next question is, Bioassay are carried out to Option A, measure the pharmacological activity of a drug. Option B, avoid clinical trial for new drugs. Option C, detect the impurity in a given drug. Option D, screen for pharmacogenetic influences of new drugs. Mention your answer in the comments. You have got 7 seconds. Let us see the correct answer. The right option is A, that is measure the pharmacological activity of a drug. I hope you are ready to take the next question. Here it is. Identify the non-pathogenic organism. Option A, Mycobacterium basis. Option B, Mycobacterium smigmatis. Option C, Mycobacterium avium. Option D, Mycobacterium intracellular. Mention your answer in the comments. Your time starts now. Let us see the right answer. The right option is A, that is mycobacterium basis. Here is the next question. Let us see if you know the answer. DNA amplification by the polymerase chain reaction uses. Option A, Thermus aquaticus DNA polymerase. Option B, DNA toposomerase. Option C, RNA polymerase. Option D, RNA helicase. Your time starts now. Here is the answer. The right option is B, that is DNA toposomerase. Few more questions left, let's move ahead and take the challenge. Metoclopramide is generally used for Option A, prophylaxis of vomiting. Option B, preventing motion sickness. Option C, treating irritable bowel syndrome. Option D, treatment of pancreatic insufficiency. Your time starts now. The right option is A, that is prophylaxis of vomiting. Few more questions left, let's move ahead and take the challenge. A conductance cell is calibrated by using a solution of known conductivity is usually a solution of Option A, N, A, C, L Option B, H, L, C, H Option C, K, C, L Option D, N, A, 504 Only 7 seconds left. Post your answer in the comments.
द राइट ऑप्शन इज सी दैट इज के सी एल वाव यू आर पार्टिसिपेटिंग रियली वेल इन द टेस्ट लेट अस सी इफ यू कैन आंसर द नेक्स्ट वन डेरिविटाइजेशन टेक्निक्स इन एच पी एल सी आर इंटेंडेड टू एनहैंस ऑप्शन ए मोलिकुलर वेट ऑप्शन बी डिटेक्टेबिलिटी ऑप्शन सी रिवर्सिबिलिटी ऑप्शन डी रिप्रोड्यूसिबिलिटी योर टाइम स्टार्ट्स नाउ आई होप यू कुड फाइंड द राइट वन ओनली सेवन सेकेंड्स लेफ्ट पोस्ट योर आंसर इन कमेंट्स The right option is B that is detectability. Here is the next one. Nuclear magnetic movement is not shown by option A 13C, option B 16O, option C 1H, option D 15N. Your time starts now. I hope you could find the right one. Only 7 seconds left. Post your answer in the comments. The right option is B that is 16 O. Here is the last one. Give it a try. Removal of a single electron from a molecule results in the formation of option A fragment ion, option B metastable ion, option C molecular ion, option D rearrangement ion. Your time starts now. I hope you could find the right one. Only 7 seconds left. Post your answer in comments. the right option is c that is molecular ion since you participated in all the questions of this gpat preparation series 3 test number 16 we really appreciate your effort we wish you all the best for your gpat preparation see you soon in the next gpat preparation series video